What is this a joke? Is this the floor on the bar? <laughs> <laughs> that is the floor on the bar. They must have extra. People are doing business here today. You really? Serious. This is open? Yeah. What, what about the tarp and the open ceiling? So this is really just for the construction. You wanted some dive. Yeah, I... We came from Carino's, which was gorgeous. It was beautiful to hear, which is a toilet. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I just threw up in my mouth a little. Close the door. Good idea. You didn't say, I want a Manhattan martini bar. You said, I want a what? Dive yeah, bar. Dive I gave bar. you dive bar. Right. I think you've got a lot of things at work here. You've got six taps already. You've got plenty of shelving space back here. You've got three drawers for your bottle beer. I actually do like the flow of the bar. I actually, yeah, something fine. positive, I agree with Eric. So when they saw this space, they were overwhelmed by how much work needed to be done. I don't know. You are really putting us to work as far as looks. No, you're putting me and him to work. You're really putting <laughs> them to work. It's going to take some blood. It's going to take some sweat and tears. That's as simple as that. You, you don't have a massive budget, so we got to make every dollar work for you. Yeah. So here's one thought that I've got for you guys. I've done it myself, where you actually allow the audience to see you develop the bar over a period of time. They will enjoy watching you take their money and you put in a new top on the bar, or you start putting a new ceiling up and let them grow with you. For what we want to do with bands, it just seems a little cramped. I don't know, Jennifer. Back there, having a stage, the way it's laid out, I really like the layout. I'm seeing potential to put a little drum riser, maybe a PA system, lights. Uh, yeah, no doubt, but it's a big workload. If they can't get it done, we're stuck with a bar with holes in the roof. We got two more rooms to check out. All right, man, what you're looking at here, Eric, is probably about uh, 100 square feet. You've got a flat top, you've got a fryer, you've got the hood in. Yeah, that could be two to $5,000 if that wasn't here. When I walked into the kitchen, I thought it'll be manageable enough for me to work with and get some food out to our customers. Other than a little bit of cleaning, not too bad. This is probably the brightest point of the place that we've seen. This is what I think is probably the coolest part of the whole place, and one that I don't think is going to need a whole lot of work. This is a cool space. It was a nice surprise walking in there and seeing the subway tile and the red felt pool table with a nice pool light over it. That's the theme that I had visualized in my head of what we wanted the bar to look like. Here is the best thing about this place. The entire property and liquor license is just $90,000. Renovations will cost you at least $25,000. But you could double your investment in the very first year with $200,000 in potential sales. 